hello guys welcome back to my channel in this video we are going to be looking at v look up which is the same thing as vatica look up so here is it v look up we're going to be looking at this what is it in excel so this is a data set where i have employees names their inventory pay commission imagine in a case where i know the names of these employees and i just want to come in and type an employee and return the pay you know the pay and if you will notice this this um particular employee's name here which is in row nine the pay is also in the same row but in the third column which is column c so i want to tell vlookup says look for a value in the leftmost column of a table and return a value that is in the same row but in column three or column two or column four of course you know this table is made of four columns which is the first second third fourth so that is what vlookup is basically all about i'm gonna wipe this I'm gonna delete this and we'll start all over again so i'm gonna use two ways to you know buttress my point so i'm gonna type vlookup and i'm gonna say look for this value comma which is the lookup value the table array where is this value contained you know this is a table And I'm gonna say row. I'm gonna specify the column. Sorry, I'm gonna specify column three, which is the column in this number. Now just choose first match. So twenty five. So definitely, this has. 25 in the third column of course you know it is the third column we specified if i change this column to column four it's going to give me the commission which is 100.9 so that is basically what vlookup is all about what if i choose you know this cell and click enter it's gonna give me an error but trust me if I enter a name in this place any name from this left column of this table is going to return a value that is in the same row but in the column I have mentioned here and I think what I have here is column 4 so I'm gonna type in the same person's name as that So yeah it gave me the same thing so any name i decide to mention from this particular column is going to return the value that is in column d if i change the column number in this formula to three back because i'm actually looking for their pay it's going to return the value in column three which is the pay so i'm gonna go back and change this name to pete so pete chris pay is 900 and you could see in column 9 we have 900 so this is basically how to use vlookup to find out a value that is in the same row according to the column you have specified thank you so much for watching my video if you find this helpful do like subscribe to my channel thank you see you in my next video bye